Hello everyone, I'm Susanna. Welcome to my channel. Today is Mohila Wayu Lesson 2, Circle Base Number 1. Okay, so today's uh, menu is like this. Alright, let's start. Now, I want to explain about yarn selling and materials first. Today, we use, uh, I use this pattern Aztec. This is the circle base. So we have to count the number of the colors. One, two, three, four, five. Five colors in the graphic. So I prepared the five colors like this. This is the color. Uh, maybe it is not the same, exact the same color, but you can change as you like. And then when you set up yarn, please use like small box like this or yarn uh, yarn ball or whatever you want to use okay so but first of all I want to rec recommend that please use small balls if you use big balls uh, it 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 needs bigger space so small ball smaller ball is better to use okay so if you don't have small balls like this please make like this this is a ball or oh, the thicker yarn but please make like small this uh, Please make like this small bowl. Okay. And then after packing in the box, please use clip like this and pull it through so you can pull it, pull it, and then not tang tangle. So it is always easy to pick the color easily like this. So that the uh, space gonna be we need four inches wide each so it is very easy to pick the color okay this is the first yarn selling nude and then materials materials today so I I mentioned about small balls yarn always should be small balls it is very easy to curling so I recommend it and the book size today's book size is uh, Japanese to the full size it is can you see the size okay two is 2.0 millimeters three 2.3 four is 2.5 millimeters please use thinner foot like this or you can use us steel hooks two to four okay i will show you Okay, this is my boy set. Four is 2.0, three is 2.0, 2.1, and two is 2.25. Or maybe you can use one. Or you can use aluminum hook size C. But I recommend this hook size is 2.0 millimeters through 2.5 millimeters. So please use this size foot uh, to make the suitable size if you use bigger foot the size is going to be very big so please use thinner, thinner foot um also uh yes i recommend the foot with clip like this if you use full metal foot it's gonna be a little bit tough work sometimes because you have to carry the many colors at a time so with the clip is maybe better to use All right and also please use stitch markers uh i will i will show you how to use later and i recommend please flip your eight paper clips it is very good to use if you don't have stitch markers please use paper clips this can work as well okay and then scissors we don't use scissors a lot but we need sometimes and then pen and rulers pen and ruler i will show you how to use from now on okay so lesson two uh part two how to read the graphic pattern all right this is the pattern today i use today this is a pattern graphic pattern and then how to read okay we start from the center and start with magic circle like this magic circle i will show you how to make a magic circle later on okay start with magic circle and make eight stitches 
we use single crochet only we don't use double crochet or half double crochet here we use only single crochet and also we use her uh, back loop single crochet okay this is back loop single crochet i will show you how to do it later on okay now make circle and make one two three four five six seven eight single crochet and then the third, second round we need to increase the stitch numbers the second will be 16 and 30 24 4 4 is 32 and the fifth is 40 like that it is a multiple of eight stitches okay and then please uh look at this carefully this is the graphic just i made for explaining all right starting from magic circle and we have one two three four five six seven eight stitches here so this line is eight starting line the starting line is always same eight and we increase the number like this so increase to the left word and to the second round we increase to the left increase to the left okay in the third round we increase to the left to the left like that like this we increase like this so to check the not our way to increase the number we can use lura like this and then how to use the pen is when you finish the stitch or round please block out mark it just you finish like that like that so you can check where you are now but basically why you mohila is very easy to check the uh, where you are now because this is a patterning graphic graphically pattern so you when you check the pattern you can find out where you are now so it is not difficult but sometimes you need uh, you are mis um, complicated so that to avoiding complication please mark mark it and block, um, block it okay so this is a, how to read the graphic pattern all right and now we want to start this circle base so but we please make a uh, please relax today please make a coaster size so if you are a beginner or volume healer do not think i have to finish like that just start and enjoy and how big you can make it if you can make this circle coaster it is enough for today and if you use thick yarn to make this size you can make a log right so if you use thinner yarn you can make a coaster or mat like that so if you can finish here you are enough for today all right so let's start okay so let's start today i'm gonna use size 3 3.3 millimeters hook and then start with magic circle here and make eight single crochet and then make second round all right okay so we finished yarn selling and materials and how to read the graphic pattern so how to start with the magic circle and how to crochet a back loop single crochet and also i will mention about the back hooks single crochet and then how to cross out of spiral k circle and how to adjust the shape and then how to increase the stitch number of the second round all right so we do at these one two three four five things together all right pick the first color first color was purple do you remember that okay so let's check the num pattern This is the purple so make let's make a magic circle and then make eight single crochet okay let's start how to magic make a magic circle is grab the grab the end and wrap the yarn around your index finger 
insert hook and pick the yarn pull through and then turn clockwise yarn over pull through okay this is magic circle one more time Grab the end, wrap the yarn around your index finger, insert, yarn over pull through, turn clockwise, yarn over and pull through. Okay. Okay, so now the magic circle was made and then let's start. Alright. Hold the other four colors together. Okay. Hold like this. Index and middle finger. Thumb and ring finger. Clap like this. Lie on the magic circle. Okay. I pick the purple yarn and hold and chain one and pull it tight. Okay, so now the end is securely fastened. Okay. Okay, now let's make eight single crochet covering these four colors together. Insert yarn over, pull through. Oops, okay. Then from the back side, Hook the yarn and pull through. This is back hook single crochet. First single crochet. Second from the back hook. Two. Three. Five, six, seven, and eight. Okay. Now put the short end of the purple so shape is circle now and cut the end of the other four colors not to show Pick the scissors so white, red, green, and blue. Please cut the end. And then pull a little. Okay. So
so color that and look and look at the other side okay pull the you can see the blue so pull the blue okay high hidden and white you can see the white so pull the white all right covered okay so move on to second round okay let's cover the purple end together before start please mark the last stitch okay start from the first single crochet this one can you see and please pick back loop only there is B stitch here but do not both chain only the back one this so ignore the front one front loop ignore the front loop and only pick the back loop insert and then cover the other colors together yarn over pull through pull it back hook and a single crochet and a second round please make two single crochet in each stitch so we made eight single crochet so that we need 16 single crochet in second round back hook single crochet into the back loop only pick the back loop only this one back hook and a back hook And sometime check the other side and pull the yarn okay so now you can see the green the opposite side so please pull the green color and let okay pull the blue so like this please make every two single crochet in each stitch with back loop and see you at the last stitch see you later okay this is the last stitch so let's make two stitches more but do not finish first and a second but do not finish here please wait here okay let's check the graphic the third round is orange so let's change the color I will use the red color so pick the red color like this this is a little bit tangle here so pick here okay and pull through with back foot pull the purple okay this is the second round and move to third round and the third round is We have to increase again so increase position is left one all right okay into the first stitch pick the back loop again this make one single crochet back foot
and this is the last stitch so we mark here okay and into the second stitch this one we need two single crochet to increase the stitch number okay like this I pull the yarn okay so now I can pick like this not to tangle here okay the next stitch is one single crochet and next stitch is two single crochet So one, two, one, two, and repeat. See you later. Okay, now the last stitch. So last stitch is two single crochet. And in this round, do we change the color? In third round, we don't change the color. Third and fourth are same colors, so let's finish this round. Okay. And then pick the stitch marker and clip into the last stitch. There are some white is looking uh, same appeared, so pull it and shape it. Okay. All right, next round. The next round is fourth round. The fourth round loop is increased into the last stitch of the eight loops. Okay, so when you look at the first stitch, this is only one single crochet in the one stitch. So always one single crochet in the one single crochet stitch. This one, this one is two single crochets in that in one stitch. So there is a light or left. This is light one. Light one is always one single crochet. How about left one? Left one is always two single crochet. the color okay next how about this one this one is only one single crochet right so make one single crochet this one is two single crochet here and this one is right or left this is right one so one single crochet this is left one left one is always two single crochet so what whenever you how many you increase this round rule is the same one single crochet is one single crochet and into two single crochet light one is one single crochet and left one is two single crochet this is a loop so pull it the yarn white okay okay one more time so one one two one one two is the fourth round loop because we need four stitches one one two And 
then continue. Okay, see you later. Okay, this is the last stitch, so let's make two single crochet. And do not finish. Okay, two loops on the hook and wait. Okay, next is clean. Please pick the clean color from the box. Then back hook and make finish single crochet. And then mark the last stitch. Okay, so let's make an, another uh, other two lines of glean now. Please uh, follow the loop of increasing stitch. Do you remember that? Okay, in the first stitch there is a one single crochet. So there is one single crochet. Always one is one. Next is also one single crochet, right? This one. So one. At the time, please make beautiful stitch. This is a tip to make beautiful back. Okay, next one is two single crochet. Like this, and this is light or left. This is light one, so light one is one single crochet. Do not pull tight. Okay. This is the left one. Left one is so. Make two. Two stitches. One. And two. Okay. So repeat it. And if you are hard to count it, just mark into the left stitch of the double crochet here a stitch two crochets stitch hole so one 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 and this is two mark into the left stitch so this is a point of oh, increasing so you never miss it okay and then finish this round and make another round okay see you later okay so after making the last stitch let's change to next color next color is I chose blue instead of black Let's change the color to finish the single crochet. Okay, and then mark it here. And then make another round of the block. Uh, I will make it with blue. And then next from next round, we can start the pattern of graphic. So let's see you then. Okay, this is the last stitch of the round of this black line and next starting from this one so starting with purple okay so let's change to purple careful not to tangle okay starting with purple and next is red 
purple and one by one and the left. So please change the marker here okay and then this is lead lead is one stitch also here and the next is white white is one one two three four five six so pick the white color from the box the white and pull the lead okay so make six white stitches one two Oops, <laughs> where is it? This one, three, four, and this one is increasing stitch, so five and six, five. And a six. Okay, so let's change the color. The next is black here. So I use the blue. So pick the blue color. In my case. Hmm. Oops. So pick the yarn from the box is to avoiding not to tangling. not tangling okay all right next is only one stitch right and then one two three four five six white color again pick the white from the box not to tangle the blue okay so let's make six stitches one two three four five <laughs> my cats are crying 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 okay stop 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 not to fight okay this is the six one two three four five six and then pick the purple again purple pull it the purple is one stitch oh no not the purple I had to pick the red okay the next is red Oops. Okay. And 
and the red and next is purple oh like stop 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 <laughs> okay so this is purple again and then do you remember we started from the purple here so at the repeating please repeat this pattern following the but uh, the graphic pattern like this okay and this is purple pull it purple here mm -mm. and then mark here and then mark this stitch here okay and then repeat all the way and then increasing the lounge right so the following the loot is increasing just before the blue line so this is the stitch marker before uh, at, at the stitch marker please increase stitch marker is just be, before the line of the eight multiple stitches right here so this line is increasing line this line is increasing line so please increase like this okay All right, so see you later.
Okay, everyone, I finished the line of the this size. Uh, it's a kind of coaster size. Okay, so I wanted to make a very flat circle, but I couldn't. Maybe there is another tip to do it, but I don't. I cannot find it yet. So when I can find it, I will tell you in the different video in the future. So, but I guess uh, the tip is not to pull tight the end of the other running yarn. So please lie the running yarn softly, loosely. Do not pull tight. If you pull tight, the shape is going to be uh, changing. So try to light a uh, loose fitting and just keep the tension just the size just size okay so let's leave you one more time yeah the part one is yarn selling and materials i use the box like this and clip like this and then clip like this and then pull the yarn not to tangle okay and then i use the hook oh uh, today i'm used 2.3 millimeters hook size 3 in japanese size or you can use two size 2 2.0 millimeters or size 4 2.5 millimeters or any steel hooks like uh, the same size 2.0 millimeter through 2.5 millimeters but uh, to consider the size please choose the light size hook because if you use a bigger hook the size is gonna be bigger okay this is the Oh, the foundation stitches to uh, the, the base size is 216 stitches to adjust the base. That this is quite a big size. And uh, the designs I recommended, they are 160 base. Is it flower? This is the smallest one. So when you consider the size, please choose the smaller size. You can see here, this is the number of the base of the circle. Okay, so when you choose 160, it's gonna be small, much smaller than this Aztec. All right, this is 1216, it's quite big. Okay, and then I will calculate actual size to uh, calculate the estimate of size. This is 13 centimeters wide. And here is nine point five, or uh, almost nine point, almost nine point five centimeters wide. So thirteen divided into nine point five is one point three six eight. So center to the end is nine point five. That's why we uh, the diameter gonna be nineteen centimeters. So by nineteen is it's gonna be twenty five point twenty six centimeters wide. Oh, uh, it divide into two. It's gonna be ten inches wide. So if you think two ten inches base is too big for you, please choose the smaller size like this, or please. Choose, uh, please use the, sm the smallest hook as much as possible. Okay. All right. So today I show you how to lead the graphic pattern. This is the graphic pattern, and from the center to outward, starting with eight single crochet, and then like spiral, make a circle this way. And when you increase, I uh, suggest it to increase just before the starting line the, these eight lines are starting line always straight and so when you increase the stitches just before the starting line so I mark it with a stitch marker this is the increasing stitches and the last stitches before the the line of multiples of eight stitches okay Alright, so I started with magic circle and then make a back loop single crochet and made a spiral circle 
and how to adjust the size please do not pull the other unused yarn tightly it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be break the shape so to adjust the shape not too tight just lie down the unused yarn and then cover the cup out with the single crochet and if you see some colors out obviously came up just pull that color very very lightly slightly do not pull tight okay so i explain about how to increase the stitch number right and how to change the colors two loops on the book and pick the new color and post through and change the color okay that's a loop it's not difficult as usual okay so this time besides next time we're gonna make uh, the rest of the base of circles and finish the basement okay so see you next time and then um, we start from this here to the end of the circle so please do it your homework to make the half size of the face and try to practice how to do it um, as much as possible if you don't like the dissolve just start over and try to do it as you like okay so see you next time bye bye